there, so today I'm doing a hair video because I haven't done one yet and I love watching hair videos on YouTube so I thought I would do my four go-to looks and they're all really easy, really simple and probably everyone in the world knows how to do them but it's just showing you how I do my hair so this is the first look, this look, this look and this look. So this is what my hair looks like when I let it dry naturally in a bun. It kind of goes a bit frizzy so I'm just gonna brush it out with my tangle teaser and then put my got to be guardian angel heat protectant spray in it before I start straightening it. Then I section my hair off and I usually straighten it in three sections. I'm just doing the bottom layer first and when I straighten it I kind of take big chunks at a time because it's just easier and quicker that way. And I feel like I'm not damaging it as much as if I use smaller pieces. So yeah, I'm just going to straighten my whole head. Then when I've done my whole head, I take pieces from around the front of my face and turn them outwards with the straightener, as if I was going to do a curl but kind of stop halfway. So I kind of focus this around the ends of my hair and just pick random pieces just to make it look more messy. Then I take a comb and back comb one layer of hair just at the top of my head to give me more volume. And that's it, that's the first look done. It's really easy and simple and it's usually what I wear when my hair is freshly washed. So for the next look I'm using this curling iron which is by Lee Stafford and I really like this one because it's 40 millimeters wide so it gives you really big kind of waves rather than curls. So for this look I section my hair off into two and I curl the entire bottom layer and I curl different widths in different directions so that it's kind of messy. So then I take down the top layer and I just curl random bits. I don't do every piece on the top and I leave some straight so that it looks really kind of beachy waves and it's not perfect. I always curl the pieces that frame my face away from my face. Then I just mess it up with my fingers and pull the waves apart and I'm pretty much done. For this third look, it's a fishtail plaid, you're going to need a little tiny elastic band if you want to pull it right to the end. Then I just bring all of my hair to one side and section it into two pieces. There are a million videos on YouTube about how to do fishtail braids, but I'll just show you briefly. So I'm taking the edge piece of one of the sections and bringing it over to the other section and then taking the very back piece of the other section and bringing it over to the other section, if that makes any sense whatsoever. But you can see here what I'm doing and it doesn't matter how messy this is because that's the look we're going for. Then once it's tied at the end, I just kind of pull it apart with my fingers and make it big and messy. I do the same for the front of my hair and you can leave 
this part of your hair out if you want it to be super messy or you can bring it around the back and clip it like I did. And that's it for this look. So for the last hair look, all you're going to need is some bobby pins and a hair bobbin. Then I just gather all my hair up into a high pony, messy as you want it to be, and just secure it. Then I begin to place bits of my hair so that I can secure them with bobby pins, kind of in a bun shape. And this always looks different, so I can't really explain exactly what I'm doing. I'm just kind of taking hair and pinning it in wherever when I like the shape. Then I just pull the bits around my face down and wrap around any bits of hair that have come loose. And that's pretty much it for this messy one look. video of my four go-to hairstyles and in particular I wear them in that order so when I wash my hair maybe the first day I'll wear it straight then second day might be curly and third day I'll put it in the plait for the texture and then the bun for the last day when it's kind of getting greasy so thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video please like it if you did and subscribe to my channel to see more bye